Hey, what's up everybody? Steve here and uh, I'm back to do a little review on some rim tape that I got. And I wanted to add some visibility and some color to my Z1. And I figured that this is an easy way to do it. It only costed me $7.99 on Amazon. I'll send you the link below. And I figured what, what better way to increase on visibility and at the same time make your bike look cool. And actually, uh, at the same time, I'm doing this on my GoPro Hero Sessions, which uh, was out of commission for a while, and I just updated the firmware and I guess refurbished the camera, and it's back to work in normal as far as I can see. So I want to say, or I want to test it out right now and make sure that it's fine uh, taking some video. So if you want to find a real cheap way to make your bike look really cool and improve on your visibility, stick around. I'll be right back. <laughs> Okay, so I got this off of Amazon. Again, it was $7.99, and it comes in a bunch of different colors, as you can see here. Um, it does add color to your bike, but more importantly, it adds visibility, especially at night when it's harder to see. Okay, so let's get started here. They came in packs of seven, and I had to cut them individually so you can separate them because they're easier to handle that way, and you can leave the adhesive backing on until you're ready to install them. Okay, so you got to find a good starting point and there's a little crease where the rim begins and ends. So start there and work your way around doing about a one inch to two inch section at a time. They are going to overlap. You're going to use about four pieces to do this rim. Uh, so overlap them by about a millimeter if you can and then continue on. And then when you get to the end, there's going to be this one was just a tad short. So I had to make an adjustment and cut an extra piece. Oh, and one more thing, um, some guys said to put it on a table or flip it upside down or whatnot. I decided to lay the bike down because it was easier for me to get leverage and pressure on, on the tape there as I'm installing it and, you know, move the wheel back and forth if I needed to. So that's whatever works best for you, go that route. <laughs> Hey folks, so that's the video for today. So if you're on a budget and you're looking for a quick and easy way to add color and visibility to your Super 73, that's how you do it. Again, if you liked the video and you learned a little something today, please hit the like, share, and subscribe button below. And until next time, take care and aloha. Mm-hmm.